Let's talk about insulin resistance. I was talking to a woman today on TikTok and she said she reversed her insulin resistance and lost weight by fasting and going from three meals a day to two meals a day. And I explained to her that the definition of insulin resistance is you have too much energy in your cells and too much circulating energy. So you've been essentially eating in a caloric surplus probably for a long time, which builds up and creates this dysfunction. So you're eating well beyond what your energy needs are. And that energy builds up, that creates the insulin resistance. And I said, the only way you can actually reverse that insulin resistance is through a caloric deficit, an energy deficit. You have to create that. And I said, the way you created it was going from three meals to two meals. I said, the mechanism that you lost weight and reversed your IR is not fasting. Fasting did not do anything here. It was the calorie deficit. Insulin resistance is very highly misunderstood. And I think it's because most people still don't understand what energy balance means. I mean, the only reason you are alive is because of energy balance. So if you need to gain weight or lose weight or maintain weight, it comes down to energy. Now, is there more nuance and context? Always. And sometimes insulin resistance can be a booger, but here's the thing. This notion that fasting is somehow doing something magical, I know that that's so counter to what a lot of so-called experts tout, but what they're telling you is not supported by evidence-based research. The research shows us people with insulin resistance need an energy deficit. They also need to exercise. We see primarily with people with insulin resistance that exercise is really key for helping to reverse some of that dysfunction. It can be a booger. I've worked with hundreds of clients who've had it. Fat loss can be slower, but principles of energy balance always apply even when you have insulin resistance. The only way your organs are keeping you alive and running is energy. Without that energy, you would be dead. 12 feet under. And so when you hear people talk about, you know, fasting being key or, you know, you got to cut your carbs because you're insulin resistant, don't want to spike your insulin. They're either lying to you to sell you something and make money off of whatever they're selling or get their videos to go viral because they make money off of their videos. So it's all money for them. They don't care if they're lying to you or they just don't understand what they're talking about. And they're banking on you to not be smart enough to know what energy balance is all about. And I think there's a fair amount of people in the general population that just really do not understand this concept of energy balance. Is there more complexity and nuance? Always. And just like I said with insulin resistance, it can be a bugger. I've seen it with clients.